Hello, Germ Squad. We live in a world of germs. And even though some surfaces may look clean, they're really not. Hi, I'm Tracy Moore with City Line, and we're getting the dirt on dirt. We sent our lifestyle experts out in the field to germ test and find out exactly how dirty our public spaces are. Shona and Leanne have amazing results. Shona, how'd you test it all? Okay, so we went out and we did ATP testing, where you swab any surface for germs. Okay. And basically, we're looking to see how many microorganisms are living on the surface. The higher the number, the scarier the results. You're freaking me out. So let me just give you an idea. Yeah. Zero to 300, we're talking clean. 300 to 1,000, caution. 1,000 plus, we are in danger. We are talking dirty, so watch out. So our mm -hmm. first one mm -hmm. is, which is dirtier, an ATM or a computer keyboard? Let's see which was dirtier. Oh, that yeah. keyboard. Is that keyboard at keyboard. work? Let's take a look at the numbers here. to touch the, the things with my I'm finger. The I, way, I, my knuckle, 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 knuckle elbow. I my knuckle yes, yes. It's in there, I'm crazy. <laughs> well, you can stop now. <laughs> Let's take a look at another one. Uh, what's dirtier, guys? A dog toy or a packed lunch? Wow. Holy moly. Ooh. Are you telling me that the dog <laughs> that goes to the park and sometimes eats his own poo uh -huh. and then comes home and plays and with his so, toy, and that's cleaner than my kid's lunch bag. Uh-huh. How is crazy, that even, right? How so is crazy. that even possible? Yeah. Now, when you think about it, though, what really is dirtier, a public restroom or your fridge at work? You might be surprised at the results. Find all the results tomorrow on CityLine. I'm Tracy Moore for City News.